Donna, kind of the broken record. How's Lindsay doing? She's doing better. Uh, she didn't practice, so she'll, she'll probably not play uh, on Thursday, but hopefully uh, we'll get her back for SEC play. And has the waiver for Taya been submitted? I, I believe it has. I believe it has. I think it was submitted to yesterday or today. Okay. I think you said immediate days. You expect that process to take about a week. Is that what you've been hearing? Or They, they said they, it's a pretty quick process, so okay. it could be a day or two. Um, she's not going, so uh -oh. <laughs> you know, she won't be playing. No, if she gets cleared today, then we'll probably get her a flight out. So I'll, I'll say that. But, you know, if the NCAA works that fast um, during this time of the season, um, we'll, be, we'll, we'll be quick to pull the trigger and get her to Philly. With the waiver, Dawn, I mean, I know that you're arguing about that. She's already sat out a year. What else is going into that waiver to try to get her cleared now? Um, I mean, she'll lose a year of eligibility. If she sits out another year, you know, she'll only have one year to play. And, you know, hopefully, you know, they'll see that. And hopefully they'll see that we got a, you know, a player down and, you know, another one's um, kind of limping her way back. And I hope they just consider, you know, all of it because I think they've probably considered all of that in some other cases. Right. At this point in the year, Coach, what, what can she bring to the team as it's constructed? I mean, we just need another body. Um, I mean, she's doing a great job at practicing. Um, I, mean, she's, I mean, she's a guard that can create her own shot. She's extremely competitive, and I think she's kind of uh, she's kind of getting complacent, just just practicing. No, no matter how much we try to try to get her mentality in, in game mode, but when you're a player and you know you see all these games being played and you're not involved, then it's hard to to stay up. So I think it will be a great boost to her, a great boost to us if she's able to, you know, you know, get eligible and play. On the game with Temple, obviously a lot of familiarity there. Is this something you've been trying to get on the schedule for a while and it worked out this year? Oh, uh, I mean, we, we wanted we wanted to, to play you know during the time in which would would make sense, and it makes sense for them to retire you know, Kansas's uh, number. Um, and when they do that, I, I wanted to be a part of it. So it, it just kind of happened at, at this particular time. What does do Candace and Temple mean to you for your career? Uh, I mean, that's, you know, that that's the platform, you know, that gave me an opportunity to coach and to impact um, young people's lives and, on a daily basis. And, um, and you know, the AD saw something in me that I didn't see in myself. So, you know, it's always going to be a great place and a you know, special place in my heart uh, because, you know, 18 years later, I'm, st I'm still doing this and I'm still happily doing it. With that being said, like you said the other night, you're going up there on a business trip to win. How easy will it be to kind of push aside the pageantry and, and the emotion and coach the game? I mean, we, I mean, we played in the Final Four. We played in the National Championship game. So nothing really compares to, to playing at, on that stage. So we can compartmentalize on that stage, surely just going back to Philly and playing Temple. Um, we can draw on those experiences. But it, it certainly is a business trip, and we want to we win the game. What did you learn about yourself at Temple that's helped you at USC? Um, I, I guess what I what I've learned is, you know, just take each day as it is and take each player as they are. You know, I know you you know you want to make an impact, but you know, players grow and learn at their own pace. No matter how much we try to, you know, expedite that process. Um, so you know, they taught me how to just, you know, kind of just uh, allow them to grow on their own terms. Um, but still not, you know, sacrifice your, your, your core values or your principles. Anything else for Thank you. Appreciate it, Don.